I got some catch up to do. There's 23 episodes technically that I've missed so far. Um, <clears throat> I want to have 365 videos by February 28th of next year. And I believe, I'm, well, I'm up to 51 with a lot of little fillers in there. I mean, technically I'm way over what I need to have, but I want the last episode to be 365. So, uh, the road to 40, episode 365, the end of the road. Um, that's what I'd like it to be, technically. I don't know if we're going to make it there or not, but I'm going to start doing these short little videos to make up some episodes. On my way home, I thought of three, so we'll be down to 20. <laughs> so I'm going to bang these out really quick, hopefully, under 10-minute videos, and uh, we'll see where it goes. But they're interesting topics, at least today. I might have to stop this one because I just got in, and I think I hear my boys coming up right now. I hear thudding, but it, maybe it's not the stairs. All right, so the first one I'm going to tackle, actually, let me tackle the middle one. I wrote these on my hand while I was driving because I was listening to the radio and just hearing different things and different words would pop out to me. And one that hit me last night was music. Music is a funny thing that really kind of, uh, it uh, signifies, I guess that's the best word to say it, certain points in your life. And yesterday when I was listening to Ice Cube, I Am the West, um, that CD and Counting Crows Sunday morning, Saturday nights and Sunday mornings um, were two albums that I can think of immediately. Lady Gaga as well. That for two summers I spent out on my porch. Um, every night I'd go out there and I'd sit out there for about an hour and just listen to music and turn the Christmas lights I got on, I have on out there and just relax. And when I was listening to Ice Cube last night, it reminded me of that point in my life. And, um, I mean, the, you know, my life hasn't always been perfect, and I've had problems and issues and stuff I'd have to overcome, but these two summers were really nice. Like, I don't do it as often, sit out on the porch. I mean, all right, I'll, uh, I'll get back to you on this one. Hang on. Part one, part two coming up. And back. <laughs> um... I guess I kind of got my point across in the last one, and I'm certainly not done on the topic of um, the subject of music. I mean, music is such a profound thing. To, to even assume that you could cover all its bases in 10 minutes is insane. But my point being is that music really does dictate or encompass certain parts of your life, certain CDs, certain albums, certain musicians. Um, it's so amazing how it really kind of just works out. Like, um, you know, I remember very clearly those nights, even the winters sometimes. I have this huge winter jacket that literally the hood can come down over to your chest if, like, you're out in the wilderness or whatever. And it's a very warm jacket. I really appreciate its warmth sometimes. Uh, I haven't used it very often here, but. I would sit outside, even through the winter sometimes, and just listen to music and, like, just to get the fresh air in. But in those times, I was listening to specific albums, like I was saying, and, like, they just kind of... Every time I hear them now, I think about that time. When I hear Ice Cube's I Am The West, I think about... It was definitely, like, summer, sitting out on the porch, and it was just beautiful outside, and, you know, the sun would be going down around 8 o'clock, 8.30... Um, it was just really nice time sitting out there and listening to music, and I, I need to get back to doing that. Maybe I can set up a camera on the side porch or something like that. Um, yeah, so I, I'd say I'll, I'm going to try to put these two together in Premiere. Maybe I'll slap the intro on the front of it, and I'll, I'll throw this one up there. Um, don't forget to make somebody smile today, and let's make the world spin a little happier together. So, um... Yeah, I got two more coming up today. I'm going to try to do three, just to try to do a little bit of catch-up. And I know this one's kind of lame because it's only about four or five minutes long. I may just go back and listen to it and re-record the whole damn thing because I was interrupted right in the middle of it. So I uh, hope you guys have a great day, and I'll be back with another one now. And I'll probably be back with at least one or two tonight uh, after I get out of work. So have a good one, and I'll catch you further on down the road to 40.